hello guys welcome to my new tutorials in this tutorial you will learn how to make these types of handwritten after effects without further ado let's get started first let's create a new composition here okay these settings okay for me then write something like uh, okay And you can choose any types of font here. No need to worry. Make a line if you want. Okay. Then click, press a right click, and then go to create. Create mask font text. Okay. Then Go to effect and preset panels here. Okay. Search scribbles. Here I got scribbles in generate. Okay. Here it is. If you want to make a single word mask, then it's okay for like single mask. Okay. But if you want to like all mask, then you can do like all mask. But there is a gap between a D inside that. If you want to make that gap, then uh, choose all masks using moves. Okay, now you can see this gap here. Okay. If you type in your choice inside is this test up looking if you choose central edge, then it will look the stroke. Uh, if you use outside edge, then it's look this inside edge is to this your left edge you can this uh, this edge will be your left side so in different way but i choose inside here okay you can make a different type of color okay if i want i will make a red color here okay so you can also make a keyframe here in colors so there's a choice you can also change the angle here like different types of angle you can use okay if you see if i play this you can see that the scrabble here but it's not that much look awesome so we have to make a little bit changes here so okay here you can change the scrabble width i will take 1.5 for me it's okay and stroke options I need a better curvedness here so like 33% or you choose your own way okay. oh, 29% curve variations or oh, like 9% spacing 3.8 space variations let's see how it's looking okay now it's look a little bit awesome and it's a bit natural here so okay okay here is a wiggle is a second per second here so you can you can increase it if you want to make more wiggles a random seat you can also increase it okay I will take one zero four. Well, it's not looking too much awesome. Okay. Now let's animate it. Okay, like first I will choose color, then angles, then start. Okay color first it will be a red okay if you press u you can see all the keyframe i make it here so okay first choose all the keyframe and press f9 so it will be easy then within two seconds i have to like to change the color so i will take like yellow or Reddish, yeah, 
this violin color okay angle so I will choose like one okay 180 181 okay and this angle this fast rotations I will like 160 if you take a huge uh, amount of rotation uh, then it will change the direction so don't take too much too difference in the uh, rotation area rotation between 20 to 30 okay okay then start first keyframe it will be like zero or like 100 sorry and then here make it zero okay now let's see if this are in the same point or not okay three keyframe in the same point now see this Okay, now to one more time. Yeah, it's good. Okay, and now copy this color free keyframe here. Control C and press Control V to create the same color. Then a rotation also sorry okay control C and control V rotation okay then create a new color here like I will create this cosy color and change the rotation I will take the first keyframe here so Ctrl C and Ctrl V ok now change the color to white and rotation Ctrl C and Ctrl V Okay. Now here make a keyframe, same keyframe here, the start and the last it will be this first keyframe. So now let's see how it's not looking. Okay, let's preview it once more. Okay, now you can see this little bit faster. You can make a little bit come forward. Okay, and this two also. Okay, now let's see the animation. yeah it's totally awesome so in this way you can do these types of animation if you like this video please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to get these types of video and see you in my next tutorial till then goodbye